Hey, what is up, you guys? This is John the Artist. And we're on our playthrough of the new Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. Came out today. With some interesting characters we've met so far. He said we can go to shrines. And that's how we can level up some more. So, I, what's going on? Huh? What happened? I didn't do anything. Oh, did I fall off the ledge? Oh, I was trying to pinpoint it and then... So, how are we gonna get there? We gotta walk. I hate walking. I want my paraglider back. What if he's like, I have your paraglider. Ouch. That was dumb. Really gotta stop relying on paraglider that doesn't exist. Uh, it's gonna take some good news to you, that's for sure. I guess I gotta think of it as the new Great Plateau. We can't leave here until we beat the four or five or six or seven or whatever shrines there are. And then we get our paraglider back, probably. <laughs> Am I supposed to like Metal Gear Solid this and like not get discovered? And do they make it easier to get hearts? Like if you get one heart for every shrine, that'd be great. What if they made it even harder? What if they're like, now you need to do eight shrine orbs in order to get one heart container. Like dude, I'm not doing that, that's stupid. I mean, I still will, but I hope it's not like that, you know? That'd be a lot. Can I, can I access this one? <laughs> yes. These are the new shrines, huh? Weird looking. A magical doorway. Okay, that's kind of cool. But wait a minute. It's the same weird, creepy aura that was around... The zombie Ganon, except his was red. Hmm. I think there was green too, though. I don't know about all this. Shrine number one. So you've made it here. This is a shrine of light. Long ago, I filled these places with light that purges evil. I believe this light will restore an ability your right arm has lost. Now then, extend your hand. This will only hurt for a moment. Ow! Now, is that what's going to happen? Do, 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 do. Oh, now we got our rune things back. Ultra hand. So then we'll probably get the amiibo once all these are filled up. That's my guess. This is the ultra hand ability. It allows you to move objects freely and attach them to other objects. With it, you will be able to build a great number of things. Really, anything you can imagine. Mm. Use Ultra Hand and receive the blessing from this shrine. Cool. And, uh... Yep, always been the same. Maybe Amiibo is ready now! Let's see. Damn it, seriously? Maybe I have to turn it on from the menu. Whatever. I think we have to fill out all of the runes just like before before I can use the amiibo. I can't climb. Am I supposed to use a new ability, obviously? So this is like Magnesis. Where am I? I can't see. Oh, here we go. Should I like make a bridge with that? 
There we go, cool. So it's like magnesis, but it can do other things than just pick up metal objects. That's interesting. We'll make another bridge. Oh no, it's not gonna reach. Can I stack them together or something? Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Can I detach it? Unstick. Yeah. You want to lay it down. What the hell? No, I don't need that. Go over there. I want to attach these two together. Maybe that will make our bridge longer. Glue. Glue them together. I'm going to do a little better job of that. Yeah! Now I pick up the whole thing. And we get a big bridge to walk on. I'm such a genius. Yeah! Now what do we need this one for? Is that supposed to trick me or something? Because I found the solution. It's that. Oh, can I grab that chest? Hmm. It's too high up. What about now? Should we use my ultra hand ability and walk up it? Yes. Whoops. Where was it? Over here? I was gonna fall on my head, fuck. Yeah! I did it! It doesn't look too sturdy, but I guess I'll be okay. Treasure chest! a little different this time okay cool Go this way oh is that our shrine orb we get we're done I have to figure out how to get there hang glider not hang glider but like uh what's it called ah Can we attach this hook to it or something? Oh, interesting. That's cool. This seems a little difficult. Eternity later. <laughs> this is difficult. Oh, here. Can we connect it like that? Bring. Now can we hold on to it? What? It was supposed to hold on to me. I guess that didn't work, huh? Maybe we need to make a thing to sit on as well as that loop. Where'd that loop go? Where'd that loop go? I need that back. Shit, did I just screw myself? Okay. Give me the loop back. We're gonna attach it to a block or something. You stay there. Take the stupid raft. We'll flip it. Um, downwards, I guess. Like 
like that. I'll put this thing on top of it. And we'll stick that on top and we'll sit on this. And that should get me across. It needs to be facing the right way. Now we have to move the entire structure sideways and jump on it before it gets away. Yeah, it's a little slow, but I figured it out. I don't know if that's how it was intended, but it seems like the best solution. Cool. A problem solved. It's pretty easy, but whatever. You have done well to reach this place. We offer you this light that will cleanse you of evil. But what about shrine orbs? What the? Oh yeah, it's an orb. Light orb. Goes into his hand. Okay. Oh, it's an orb. Yep, exactly. Crystal that glows with the light that purges ancient evil and pur purifies with its radiance. Light of blessing, shrine orb, same thing. Gonna collect four of them, I guess. May the light of blessing grant you the strength you seek. Okay, I got it. Wonder what our new powers are gonna be. Oh shit, there's so many different things you get. The only thing I know for sure is Ultra Hand, so I am really in the dark with this one. Okay. Where's the next shrine, I guess? You did very well getting through that shrine, and you've restored an ability. This is wonderful. If you visit and complete two more shrines, you should be able to open the door to the Temple of Time. Two more shrines, really? Oh, you mean three? Maybe you don't need as many anymore. You may want to mark the shrines in the distance with pins. Then you'll never lose track of where they are. The Pura Pad allows you to use a very useful scope. It's quite handy. Ah, oh, cool. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's always it's been the same, isn't it? Okay, got it. So, looks like there's one over there. So, we'll pinpoint that one. And I don't know if there's any that are close by. Oh shit. I, I guess that's where we need to go, huh? That's far. Okay, cool. So, next round is over here, I guess. Hopefully I can get there in four minutes. Before the episode is over. Uh, climbing is probably a good idea here. Oh, shit. Okay, and then we need to make some kind of a bridge. Oh, here we go. Perfect. We know how to attach these together. Amiibo's ready! Oh, shit! I kind of want to get that new armor now. I doubt it's gonna drop it immediately, but so hopefully by the next episode, you guys, I will have my green outfit back. That's what I want. So it just feels like Zelda again. Take away my master sword. Oh, I know. So like that kind of sucks. But I like this new Ultra Hand ability. Good enough. Just needs to serve its purpose. Looks like we need to make another one to get to cross to the next side. So where did I say I was gonna go? I already lost sight of it. There. Where 
What is that? Is that the ghost dude or whatever? He has a giant hair. I see that you're still at work even now. We originally created the constructs to assist in our endeavors. All of us were fond of them. I never imagined they would continue to carry out their assigned tasks to this day. The fact that their labor no longer serves any purpose, yet they perform it still, is quite disquieting to me. Is that even a word? Okay. Can we fuse this together? I haven't learned that move yet, have I? Oh wait, yes we did. So what would I do? Grab this stick? Oh, sword's broken. Uh, equip that. Uh, can we fuse? Do I have to put him on the ground or something? Yeah. So I have to drop it? Aha! Uh -huh. Now we got a big boy bat. Let's make sure we do it perfectly though. So like put this right in the center so it feels like a club or whatever. Yeah. Hey, how do I pick it up? I almost did it. Drop the stick. Grab it with ultra hand. Move it onto the object with some glue. Magic glue. Attach. Okay, now. How do I use this? Maybe I haven't learned that ability yet. I'm trying to be too cool too quick. Fine, I guess we can't do that yet. Was oh, that the good guy? How would I know? They all look exactly the same. <sighs> Sorry, dude. something. Rusty broadsword. I dropped it on the ground. I could use it to break open that box real quick. I just got the wrong weapon in his hand. That means this episode is over. Thanks so much for watching, you guys. I make a new video every Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.